So I've already applied my face makeup on and I did some subtle highlighting and contouring and you can check my other video for that. And now we're going to move on straight to the eye makeup because we're going to be skipping brows. And first you want to take your favorite eyeshadow primer and apply this evenly all over the top and bottom lip area. Don't apply too much because that will actually cause creasing. And then I'm going to take my NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil, and this is a green color. Apply this all over the mobile lid. Don't apply too much because it can cause creasing. And then just pat it on using your ring finger to blend it out. Next, I'm mixing Vanilla and Shroom for MAC and applying this onto the brow bone as highlight. You want a slightly shimmering light color on your brow bone. And then take a warm brown matte shade, apply this along the crease using a fluffy brush in a blending motion. Blend it out in a cat eye shape. Using permanent khaki from L'Oreal Infallible, place this around the outer and inner third of your eyelids, staying clear from the centers of your lids. And then using a dome shaped brush, take a darker matte brown and start sculpting this color around the outer V of your eyes to deepen the look. Taking a shimmering light green color, place this around the centers of your lids to bring more dimension and then run the two previous green colors all the way around the lower lash line. This is similar to what Omer Thurman had as Poison Ivy. Taking a gold shimmering color, place this around the inner corners blending into the former colors. Rim the waterline using a creamy jet black eyeliner pencil top and bottom. This will intensify the look. Next, I'm taking my Wet n Wild Black Cream Eyeliner. Start lining the upper lash line. You want to create a subtle cat eye, almost a little bit like a baby cat eye I might say, because you don't want an overly dramatic eyeliner look. Curl your lashes and I'm going to straight to false lashes. And you want to look for flared ones, which means they are longer in the outer corners to extend your eyes. Curl your real and fake lashes together and coat them with mascara to bend them together seamlessly. This will make a more natural effect to your lashes. Line around the upper lash line again using a black liquid liner. Here I'm using NYX the Curve Eyeliner. Now for the fun part. I actually created this eyepiece myself, so excuse the horrendous state. And you just want to place it first without gluing it. And using a white eyeliner, start making dots or guidelines to where you're going to place it. And to where you're going to place it, other than the brow, apply some lash glue. And then just stick them on, place it in place for a couple seconds, and you're done. For the face, I'm first going to contour using my sleek contouring kit. Using an angled brush, I'm going to contour the sockets of my cheekbones and sides of the nose to emphasize the features. For blush, the photo reference actually showed that Emma Thurman had a slightly more orangey blush, so apply this with a light hand on top of the bronzer. For the lips, I'm mixing two lip colors, the first being OCC Lip Tart Cha Cha, and this is just a very light, almost tangerine color. I dabbed on some Sleek Pout Paint in Lava, which is a red, and top it all off with gloss for that deathly kiss. And for the hair, you want to go with a red hair, but I tried to spray paint mine, it kind of failed. I suggest getting a wig, you guys, if you don't have red hair. And now your look is complete. This is perfect for uh, Halloween costume parties, or if you want to wear the eye makeup without the crazy accessories, you can definitely rock it. Thank you so much for watching, and again, this is a huge collaboration that I'm very grateful to be in, the Beauty YouTubers Facebook collaboration. After this, you guys should have a bunch of videos to watch, so be sure to check them all out. There was a lot of work and effort put into every single one of them. We dressed into different superhero or super villain characters. So thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and check out the other channels as well. And I'll see you guys in the next video.